Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Tasha of Tasha's Budget. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about my financial problems, things that have changed, items in my shop, and we also going to be cash stuffing um, money today. We are cash stuffing $44 today um, as we talk. So I'm going to get through the cash stuffing first, and then we'll talk about the financial problems, things that have changed. Um, things that I changed in my binder for is what I was doing before. I believe I'm always in the change season. It doesn't look right to me. It doesn't find, feel right to me, so I change it up. So today we're going to cash stuff $44. Let's cash stuff our money. This is my bank slip. I went to the bank and gave them this, and then they did what I asked. And this also is available in my shop. So we are going to get in this bank bag also comes with a bank teller slip and a withdrawal teller slip. Okay. So let's count this. 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So $44 is what we're going to be cash stuffing today. Just set this up over here on the side. So here's my budget binder. I have it all worked out and everything. So the first one that we're going to get to is going to be my crossword. This also is available in my shop where you find the words at the bottom and you cash stuff that amount that the word that you find so in this one we're gonna be trying to cash stuff nine dollars ten at the most so i got my handy dandy highlighter so let's see we will look for hmm let's Let's see what word can we find. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have one word right here. We have wallet. I'm gonna cross it off down here so I know we got it. And that's worth six dollars. So let me get five and my six. Okay, and then we have, let's see, what other word can we find? <sighs> wow, I made this kind of difficult, but not difficult, but I... I did a good job on this one. Ah. I know which word I'm looking for. I just don't want to say it out loud just yet. But I know what word I'm looking for. And it's on here. I know it's on here because I put it on here. It's on here. All right, we have bank right here, and bank is worth $4. So six plus four is actually 10. So I'm gonna put that back and just take, I'm gonna take two fives, and we're gonna put it here. I have my labels for this one for crossword puzzle um print it over there in the back i just have to put it on the transfer paper so i could put it onto the binder let me put this back in the back all 
All right, now let's move on to our scratch and save. Last time we scratched off five dollars. Let me go get my tool. Okay, I got my tool so we could do the scratch and save. And like I said, last time we did five dollars. This time we're gonna try to do ten. Nine or ten. Okay, let's scratch off this one. Mm. Get it mixed up which end I want to scratch off. All right. And we have three dollars. One, two, and three. Let's do let's do this one next to it. Let's just keep it all in a group. Alright, this one is six dollars. So six and three equals nine. So five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So in this one, our scratch and save, we have five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen dollars. Okay, and while we have this one out. I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about my financial problems. Well, not really problems, just things just got to get better. And I got good news um, yesterday that things are getting better. Um, my rent has got lower because I am on housing assistance. And my rent just got lower. So I'll be saving more money. Um, two, this, like I said in the previous videos, I'm not cash stuffing my bills because most of my bills come out automatically i am just stuffing for to save to save so with this scratch and save even though i have three separate challenges this is the 50 dollar one um i have the hundred dollar one and i also have the 200 dollar one when i finish this scratch and save all the money that i i save from here I'm going to put it into another binder, which is going to be my 100 envelope binder. So that's going to start off that binder. So I'm going to finish small challenges to go to a bigger challenge, if that's understandable. Also, with the crossword puzzle, I'm going to do the same. So with the crossword puzzle, you save $110. So once I'm finished with my crossword puzzle, once I complete the whole crossword puzzle, I save $110. And that I will move over to my um, 100 envelope binder. And in that binder, you save $5,050. So these two challenges will go towards that. Okay. Now in my 4K binder that I have, I put those envelopes inside this binder. So I won't have so many binders. Just keep everything in one spot. So in this binder, we're going to be adding five dollars to it which is going to make these each butterfly represents five dollars and i saved 250 so we already have 20 in here 5 10 15 20 we're going to add a five to it so that's going to be 5 10 15 20 25 and i'll color this off screen So basically that's my financial problems I was telling you about in the $10 challenge. We're going to add $10 to this one that leaves us $40. So we'll have $40 in this one. So as I was saying, that was my financial problem because it's been hard for me to save. I'll start saving, but then... The kids need something in the house. School is about to start. They need this. They need that. It's always something that the kids need. And the money that I save, I end up going into it. And I know I shouldn't be doing that, but that's what I've been doing. So that's what's been keeping me afloat. Now, these last $10, I'm going to put in um, my other challenge binder, which is the 
$50 a month, $600 for the year is my mini savings challenge that will go into that. But um, actually, let me go get that. Okay, I had to go get my mini savings binder. This one is also available in my shop. The 4K um, savings challenges is also available in my shop. So basically, anything that you see me working with today in this video will be on my shop. Um, I also have a Black Friday savings challenges. For um, Black Friday, when it comes out, you save $500 with that one. But as I was saying, my financial troubles are a lesson. I've been trying to save and bills have been high. So that's the reason why I save and then I have to go back in. And it's like I'm starting over, starting over, starting over. And as you guys can see, um, the last video, if you want to go back and look at my videos, my first binder um, tracker envelope or whatever you want to call it, it was for vacation. That's still going to happen. And then the next one behind that was for my wedding. That's still going to happen. But it's not to 2025. So we have time to save for that. And if I save the little bit from the scratch off and the crossword, and put that towards my 100 envelope challenge. There goes some money that we could use towards our wedding. And I'm going to redo these challenges. It might not be once I do the crossword puzzle. I'll find another one to do because I have plenty. And there's a lot of shops that I, I've been favoring on Etsy. That has other ones that I could try out their stuff. Every little bit adds up. So I'm going to finish this off. And then I'm going to save that money into something bigger. That's the plan. That's what I'm going to try to stick with. But everything changes. Everybody's budget is completely different. Um, my budget is changing. So it'll work out. I'm just working with God. It'll work out. So as I was saying, in this binder, it's a mini savings challenge. You save $600 for the year and you do $50 each month. So um, this is... Today is June 30th, which is the last day of the month. So I'm just going to start off June, um, July, which you see, guys, it's empty because I started saving and then I went into it. it it's a whole bunch. It's a whole bunch. So we're just going to go on July. And all my, all my trackers for July. Why are you stuck? Get out of there. All the spots for July equals 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, $50. And I'm going to put my first 10 in there for July. So at the end of the month, I should have $50 in here. Should. Keyword is should. Um, but you never know. But for right now, we're going to put this $10 in there. It's an ugly 10. But we're going to put it in there. And then a little extra money that I get throughout um, the month. I'll put in here. I'm going to do this one at least once a week or once every two weeks or however. I do have a friend guy at work that collects um, cans and stuff like that. I haven't collected cans since school let out. So when I see stuff on the side of the road um, that I know he could scrap, I call him and I let him know. And he gives me like this little finder's fee. So that little finder's fee could fill up this for the month. So... That's what I'm going to do. So, thank you guys for watching my video. Thank you guys for listening to me. Um, I think it's one more thing else I want to say. I do. I'm going to try to start putting more videos out. That's one thing I have to be more consistent on. So, I did come up with a schedule. So, I won't have to catch stuff all the time. It's still going to be weekly. But it's just going to be different days. So, one day a week, I'm going to do my crossword. Another day of the week, I'm going to do my scratch and save. And then the other days, I'm going to do my cash stuffing, which is three different videos, three days a week. And that's what I'm going to try to stick to. Um, my mini binder will be consistent as um, a cash stuffing. The other ones will probably be just little mini ones because it's just a crossword and a scratch off. But... That's what I'm trying to do. I just got to get my days figured out on when I want to do it. And that's it. I have other things I'm trying to plan on. Plus, I'm um, trying to weight loss, trying to lose weight. 
not a lot, but I just want to feel good about myself. Um, so, again, thank you for listening. Thank you for interacting with me in the comments. Um, again, please like, comment. As always, I will get back to you and subscribe. I know I have two new subscribers in the past week. Thank you guys so much for that. And, and that's it. But thank you guys. Like I said, today is Friday, June 30th, the last day of June. Tomorrow is July 1st. Um, I am off until Wednesday because of 4th of July. I'm going to celebrate the best that I can. So once again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, all these, everything that you saw in this video is on my website at tashasbudget.etsy.com. This mini binder comes in multiple colors. The money bag comes in four different colors. And the scratch and save is in the, in the, the shop, uh, three different styles and they're all different. So nobody will get the same one. They're all different. Um, the crossword puzzle is also in there and my full K challenge is in there and they come in different colors. So I have it in purple, um, pink, blue, and yellow. So once again, thank you again for watching and you guys have a great night. Bye.